Hello guys and welcome back to another tutorial for Creator. Today what we're going to be doing is covering the energy cable settings and then we're going to be covering the update tick in the next video and then the following video after that we'll be covering the block adding procedures and there's a couple of those so we'll be covering those in the next few episodes so the important part is what direction the actual cable is facing. If you have your own cable, I've used a 4x4 or rectangle that we can use for a cable. The output is red and the input is blue. The input is facing south while the output is facing north. That will be important when you're actually modeling your cables for the particular script that I have. We'll be covering that. Make sure that you export it as this direction. You also might want to set your calling for your north side and your south side as calling south for south and calling north for north. This will just make sure that these faces are disabled if it's connected to another block that's solid. That being said, let's move on to mCrater. We will cover the cable. So let's search up cable. We have an energy cable. So after you've imported your resources you need a texture for your cable you need your model for your cable as well when you have done that we can start working on the settings this particular model i've just set the same model as the texture that i've used for it for the particles i've set the model here it's called copper energy cable straight now i'm going to be changing that to just energy cable because that's a little bit long i was going to use a different system but it doesn't need to be anything more than just energy cable then what you want to do is set the rotation for down up north south west east rotation on player side make sure the model is for cutout and is transparent next what you want to do if you're using the exact same dimensions as what I used you want to make sure that the dimensions are for minimum X and minimum Y 0 0.375 and for maximum X and maximum Y you want 0 0.625 set the GUI name just to energy cable I've set the property to cloth because it gives a unique sound and it's just it seems to be more fitting for cables that way than having something like a metal sound or anything like that as well as the material so I thought I would keep those two the same it's under its own inventory tab as well the hardness and resistance is two I figured that was probably going to be more than enough hardness and resistance to actually break the rest of the settings down here are all the same as well as up to this point so we haven't set a tool to be able to destroy it the harvest level is set to zero so we can break it with our own hand. Other than that, nothing else here is outside of default. Tick rate, you want to set this to one. We'll be using a randomizer so we can reduce lag. You want to set the block color or map to something that is most prominent in your actual texture itself. You can usually find map colors on Minecraft Wiki to see what colors for blocks in vanilla Minecraft fit under that category. Black is for black wool and other things like that. So I've just used black for that texture. Outside of all this, uh, all those are default as well as this one here. I've used flammability. So I've set it the same as wood or planks, which is set to five. We want the reaction to being pushed to destroy it and basically drop the block, which will happen if it's destroyed here. The rest of these settings are all the same. It doesn't have particles, so we can move on to tile entity. We need to enable tile entity because we're going to be using variables. We're also going to want to disable the amount of slots, set that to zero, and we want to disable these two checkboxes down here. For forge energy and forge fluid storage, uh, we haven't used any of that, so we can move on. We do have two procedures hooked into this particular block. Uh, the first one is one block is added and update tick. Now we'll be covering update tick at the next episode. Uh, moving on to generation, there isn't anything being generated for the actual block. All right, so that's about it for the cable itself for the properties. So if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, comment down below, rate the video, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Peace out.